Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to another video for the Black and Silver Way. Uh, sorry about the videos yesterday. I ended up taking them down. Yesterday was kind of more of a reaction video. I recorded them pretty much when the game was going on, and I was really angry and really shocked. I didn't like the videos, so I ended up taking them down. Yesterday, we lost 24-31, to 31, and it was a very disappointing loss. We were whipping the Cowboys' ass. We should have won the game, but our team just completely shut down in the second half of the game, and we lost, and we gave up 21 unanswered points. So that was really bad to see, and uh, this has been happening for the last 10 years or so. But hey, we're going to deal with it. And quick announcement real quick. I'm actually going to be doing the videos the day after if we lose. I could do the videos when we win because I'm happy and I could actually think. But if we lose, especially any kind of game, I'm just going to warn you guys I'm going to be doing the videos the next day because I, I'm over the loss. I could talk stats. I could talk football. I'm not as mad as I was yesterday in all the other videos because when I do it the same day, I end up not making a good video or I have to re-record them. It's just we're going to do it the next day. So that's another announcement. And one more announcement. Today I was actually at work and my boy was like, hey, have you seen that? They're the Philadelphia Eagle blogger Eat That Pussy 445's new video. He actually calls out the Raiders and talks a bunch of shit about the Raiders. I was like, no, I haven't seen it. You know, I could kind of care less, but I ended up checking it out anyways because, you know, I'm going to check it out. And um, I'm cool with him and everything, but uh, yesterday I lost a lot of respect for him. I actually lost all respect for him, and I unsubscribed from him. So if you're watching this video, eat that pussy four four five. Just remember, the Raiders beat uh you know beat the Eagles, dominated them in the Super Bowl. Yeah, it was in the 80s. Yeah, it was a long time ago. But when's the last time? You know, it's just it, it, we we kicked your fucking ass in the Super Bowl. We've always dominated you every time we play you. We've won you guys way more times. We have more Super Bowl rings than you guys. We have more Hall of Famers than you guys. We have a better history than you guys. We've been on a 10-year loss, and it's been a really long, shitty you know, journey of this whole thing losing. But for you to go to Oakland and for you to hang out with all the fans and act like, you're, oh, you guys are cool, I respect Raider, the Raiders, I respect the fans, uh, and then you have to come and make a video like this. Next time you come to Oakland, I'll make sure everybody knows you think our franchise is an embarrassment to the NFL. We're the worst franchise in the, out of the whole NFL. We're fucking gay, all this shit. You know, I don't want to hear it. That's fucking stupid. You played it off like we were all cool and everything was good. I don't respect you at all anymore. I don't talk shit about fan. I don't talk other things about other people's teams. If they want to talk a bunch of shit about my team, that's where this has to, this thing has to start. But I really don't want to waste my energy on it. I just want to let you know I don't respect you anymore and I unsubscribe for you anymore. And, uh, you know, when you talk a bunch of shit about my franchise, about the franchise I love, it doesn't matter who you are. I just lose respect for you and I don't talk to you. I just, uh, you know, pass on you. You're pretty much a faggot. So just wanted to get that off my chest. That's all we have to do. So let's get into some stats, guys. Yesterday during the game, we had a touchdown right off the bat, 23 yards. Greg Jenkins picked up a fumble recovery, 23 yards, and it was shitty to see. I mean, not shitty to see. Sorry, guys. It was good to see. It was good to see. And then we ended up uh, fumbling the ball. Then they ended up scoring. So it was 7-7. Seven to seven. And then we ended up getting a touchdown from Rashad Jennings. We pulled it all the way to the one-yard line, pushed it in. It was 14-7. to seven. And then we got another touchdown. It was 21-7. to seven. And then right before the second quarter ended, and the halftime, they ended up driving it all the way on us, and we ended up getting a touchdown. So it was 14 to 21 at the time. As soon as the Cowboys got that touchdown, I said, "It's not over. We're probably going to lose this game because it's going to be hard to keep fighting back in the second half." Because that's how the Raiders are. They're just a first half team, and that's it. And that's how it's how it's been. Right when the second half started, they scored. So then we ended up uh, fucking. Uh, they ended up getting an interception. They score. It's 28 to 21. This game's already over. I already know it's over. I'm just hoping that it t they don't go and score anymore. And they did. They scored a field goal. It was 31 to 21. And then on the last drive, we ended up scoring, and it made it 24 to 31 final. Very disappointing. I had to deal with two losses this week. Fitzpatrick tore us apart. Tony Romans tore us apart. I am sure that we might lose against the Jets coming up here. I don't know what's really going to happen on this game, but I'm not looking forward to it at all. I'm actually going to be going to the Chiefs game the next following week, and I'm just not looking forward to this season at all. I'm just going to be doing my recap videos, not really paying attention at all, because, uh, you know, that's it. That's just my personal choice. You know, you guys respect it. You guys don't respect it. So uh, it's really hard to see this team. You know, I'm just waiting for next year. Hopefully we can make something happen next year. 
maybe I don't know what they're going to do. If they're going to jump ship on Dennis Allen, on the coaching staff, whatever we do. We've been going through the same shit over and over again. I don't know what this franchise is going to do, but I'm going to back them up 100%. I'm going to keep doing my videos. I'm going to keep watching the Raider games, and I'll keep doing these videos for you guys, like I said. So thanks again for watching. Make sure to hit that like button. Even though there's not really anything to like, I know, guys, this franchise and this whole team has turned to shit again, and it sucks. But, you know, after every dark day, there's a brighter day. Tupac, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, really, guys. You just got to stay positive and ride it out like we've been doing the last few years, uh, last 10 years. But anyways, Eat That Pussy 445 video will be in the description. You guys can check it out, comment on it, do what you guys got to do so you guys aren't, like, thrown off. Like, who's this guy? What's the video? Where can I find it? It's going to be in the description below. But, you know, that's it. I hate people that talk shit about the Raiders. If you talk shit about the Raiders, I don't talk to you. I don't fuck with you. Nothing. So, thanks again, guys. I'll see you guys next time for the Jets recap. Peace.